Hello, how are you? Counting by two often gets tricky, though counting by five and ten becomes a lot easier. So today I am going to tell you the method by which you can teach your child how you can they can do skip counting by two. So skip counting is nothing but it's adding the same number over and over again like 5 if you add 5 more you will come to 10 and you can have this kind of a chart it becomes very easy to show it to the child and it with different colors so it becomes even more easier if I start from 2 4 6 8 10 I start from 1 from 1 jump over and land at the following number that is 3 from 3 I jump over so means I am ju jumping over 4 so jump over and land at 5 and from 5 I am jumping over and landing at the following number 7 so this is the way to skip count by 2 you add 2 over and over again like 2 again add 2 4 6 8 10 so this is a hundred chart and when I am doing skip counting by 2 I will start with 2 I will jump over and land at the following number here I am what I'm doing I'm adding 2 I'm adding 2 again I'm adding 2 the same way I'm doing over and over again so this is what we have to explain that every time you skip count by 2 you are adding 2 every time like 2 4 6 8 so you can use different manipulatives like these cubes are really great because it helps them to count and it becomes it's very hands-on activity another activity that you can do if you don't have a cubes then you can use the buttons like buttons is are generally found ev in every home so like you can you just start on any number like you start on 12 then ask your child to count by two so start skip jump over start skip jump over so this is uh, you can use this method too other than your cube method so it's always interesting if they have different manipulatives these marbles the and this is also a very and you don't have to only start something from twos you can start from any number like I start from 41 so I have to, uh, from 41 I skip over and jump on the following number again I skip over and jump on the following number so what I am doing here here too I am and skip and jumping over and landing on the following number so I'm adding two to each number then 47 so this is one very easy activity and you can they can sh do so many things another thing that is commonly found in a house is the calendar so whenever a month is over then you can to take those calendars sheets and you can ask your child to practice and be like what I have is a laminated one so if I write anything you can easily rub it off too so suppose you like right now it's a month of July and today the date is um, it's an old calendar though um, so suppose if the date is 10 so you ask your child what's the date today he will say 10 then you can ask them to circle it 10 now skip by 2 so what you will do start skip 
you have to start jump over this number and land on the following number start jump over land on the following number so these are some of the worksheets that I normally do with my school kids so here is skip counting by two here they will count two four six so from this they have to choose eight is there no so which numbers are there two is there four is there six is there the same here like uh, how many birds are there two no six no four here how many faces are there two and again count by two four now here you see i have written the numbers and they have to trace the number by two so if they like here is two so they will trace two after that they will not trace three they will count by two and they will trace four so start jump over land at the following number that's how they have to trace start jump over land at the following number so this is another worksheet which they can do on by tracing the numbers third worksheet that you see here is they have to write the missing number by twos so this is two four so what will come here so they have to add two to four so they have to add two every time so you have to tell them that you have or you just put here now add two so four five six now what next again you bring this here so they have to add six seven eight now it's ten again bring it over so 10 11 12 so this is another great way they where they will see that they, every time they have to add two so in this way you can either put two beads or something but this is a very good way to teach them the skip counting especially for writing the missing number because this becomes little and difficult for them and this is one interesting worksheet which the kids will like so this is dot to dot by two s so all the numbers that you see here is written by twos so they will start from two here now they will start connecting four six eight ten and 12 14 16 so in this way they are going to connect all the twos number and they they will read also so that they know that all these numbers are by twos so I, like 44 after 44 there is not 45 it's 46 they are adding the two number so if they don't understand then again bring the cube and show them 44 45 46 that's why you got 46 here so this is also a very good activity and then they can color it when a child starts knowing the skip counting then you can introduce the word problem so but but before that they have to be comfortable with the other worksheets so here count by twos so zero two four six eight ten what is two less than eight so if they have eight then what will be less than two less than eight so that will be six what is two more than ten means they have to add two so it will be twelve and they can write like this eight minus two if you want to explain them or ten plus two equal to 12 so count by twos and circle so you, the, the number given number is 12 so they have to count by twos so 12 after 12 which number will come 14 then what will come 16 17 will come no 18 here again the same thing it's 24 what will come next if they count by 2 26 then 
28 not 25 and 27 last worksheet that i'm sh showing here is you have to draw a line it's a line bar and then they have you just uh, write one number at any place and then they will fill up the rest so they have to skip counting by twos so two four six eight ten now here is eight so what will come before eight six so what is eight eight six is two less than eight now ten twelve the same here is twelve so what will come before twelve two less than twelve two less than ten so these are the worksheets uh, that uh, you can try with your kids and hope you like this video and if you like it don't forget to subscribe my channel and leave your comment that will help me to know more